Alright, so what are we doing today? We're going to recondition down GV5, but we're going to flex them a little bit before we recondition. Jesus, these things are massive, yo. Look at the size of these things. Yeah, this is like the third time we're recalling these exact speakers. The customer just uh, is destroying them, apparently. supply just kicked on that's 120 amp hours uh, power max and it's drawing Four five. five amps turn it up let me see what it how much it draws on ah, about 50 something amps but the lights are dimming in the house unfortunately that amp can't blow out these speakers but definitely getting them moving though all right it? All right, so let's stand it up and see what it does. Oh, the whole floor. Oh, the whole floor shaking. Okay, that, that, that they're gonna call the... That was a bad idea. That was a dumb idea on my part. All right, so... Wow, that's real cool. Look how much that... Oh, that tinsley moves like about two See what difference it makes without a surround. All right, let's hook up this one. All right, so now let's see what it does without the, the surround. It has a surround. Ah, uh, shaking Should the floor more though. Yeah, you know what? Tilt it because it's shaking the floor too damn much. All right, this one's not shaking the floor too much. My bottom out a little. Oh, but it looks so cool. Wait, let me know what the spider is. I mean, not the spider, the tinsel. Shoot. Bottom up. Yeah. Oh. It looks funny. Though. Oh. Is it actually feel air from it even without the uh, surround? I look how small it is without the surround. I know it's like a little eight-inch speaker. Let's uh, wrap this up. All right. So that's it, boys and girls. The amp cannot blow out these speakers no matter what. I guess if we clip it like crazy, it'll probably eat up the floor. Because I feel this. Oh, look how it's like just staying up by itself. And isn't that crazy? Huh. All right. That's it. That's it. All right. Say bye. Bye.